Hello, welcome to SVG. This is your boy Jay Howard, and I'm back. Um, I haven't talked to you guys in a while about NBA Live, but I have some good news. I know a, uh, a lot of you guys probably already heard already. I probably already saw it on Pasta Padre with the article about the new franchise releases, the new games they're going to drop. In that article, it stated that NBA Live will return this fall. I want to know what you guys think. This is something from EA Sports. This is the first thing they dropped since they told us they wasn't dropping the game this year. I mean, last year. And this is the first information that I have read about NBA Live. So I want to know what you guys think. Are you still anticipating the return of NBA Live 14? Yes, it said NBA Live 14 will release this fall. When I think about this, it's hard, really. I'm just going to be totally honest. It's hard. To plug myself back into EA Sports to wait on them to drop another basketball game. But every time I pick up that controller and play NBA Live 10, I just imagine how 13 would have been or how 14 is going to be. Let's talk about the positive for a minute. One thing I think that's the positive for EA Sports is that nobody really talks about 2K other than this point right now. The season is, is in. The real season is in. It's almost over with about it's around playoff time. You don't hear a lot of people talking about the 2K basketball game, and that's not a bad thing. But I think overall, basketball games are really dying out a little bit, in my opinion, as far as in the video game world, especially with the sports games. They're not as popular as, as they used to be. I mean, 2K um, is the only game on the market. And despite, you might say, well, 2K is a good game. It's a great game. It's not enough. And I don't care how you look at it. That's how come I made the video a couple of weeks ago. I've been busy with my sports show. I haven't had a chance to really do anything else. That's why I made the video talking about the fans creating a game for Sony and the PS4. Because when you think about it, I brought 2K and I'm, seriously, I, I might have played, real talk, 20 games on that game. I tried a season like three times. I just can't stick to it. PS3 went out, got a new PS3. I got my PS3 for Christmas. It was a Christmas gift. Man, I started playing my NBA Live like the end of... January really because I had to get my rousers and stuff right I'm at like 40 games right now like 33 to 40 games somewhere up in there with my season with the updated rousers on my NBA live because I like playing NBA live I want to know I mean that speaks volumes that if you didn't catch what I just said I'll repeat it we need more than one basketball game if I'm playing our old game from three years ago 2K isn't enough. Are you guys still anticipating the return of NBA Live? Let me know. I'm your boy, Jay Howard. I'm not going to hold you guys. I want to hear your guys' comments on the return of NBA Live 14. And are you still anticipating it? Let me know. Peace from SVG.